Hi there, everyone. Meteorologist Rusty Dawkins at KLKN Channel 8, that ABC station in uh, Lincoln, Nebraska. We've got uh, some snow to talk about. Not a huge deal, uh, but the northern fringes of the state of Nebraska from the northwest uh, portion of the Panhandle through Cherry County, O'Neill, off towards Sioux City may see a decent amount of snowfall. So let's take a look at what, uh, what Stormcast has. Uh, by 7 p.m. Friday evening, snow starts to spread uh, across the Panhandle into north central northwestern Nebraska, makes a w makes its way across north central into northeast Nebraska. Now, some of this is going to try to spread towards I-80. It's going to have a tough time doing it. It will try. Uh, notice right there, along Interstate 80, a rain-snow mix. Not expecting any ice out of this, by, uh, by the way, uh, but the heavier snow up here towards Valentine, O'Neill, Sioux City, and then that all moves off to the east as we head through Saturday morning and into Saturday afternoon. So let's take a look at what the models are saying. Uh, this is model number one. It has that swath from about Shadron, Gordon, south and west uh, towards uh, Norfolk, O'Neill, Ainsworth, and Valentine. So north central, northwest Nebraska, parts of northeast Nebraska. Uh, but again, the along Interstate 80, lesser amounts. This is just one model. I don't really trust that one. That one seems a little high. Uh, as is usually the case with model number one. Model number two, a little better. Uh, I think Valentine, Ainsworth, O'Neill to Yankton, that seems a little high, but this is going to be a relatively light, lighter snowfall, like a, a fluffier snowfall, so uh, it could accumulate faster. I believe this more, though, less than an inch from about Mullen, Broken Bow, Columbus to Omaha South. Okay, model number three. Did, did, did about the same thing, over six inches uh, north central and northeastern Nebraska, less than an inch uh, along and uh, just north of Interstate 80 and then into the Panhandle, one, two, maybe three inches of snow. That seems a little high though for Yankton. I, you know, uh, it's already happened this year though, so I guess these <laughs> sometimes these models are right. This one's saying it too. Uh, so the the potential is there for some heavier snow. Five, six inches seems about right to me. Uh, maybe up to 8 inches, but 9, 10, 12 inches, that seems high. Uh, but along uh, Interstate 80, uh, less than an inch, and then uh, 2 or 3 inches in, into parts of the panhandle. Mon model number 5 has uh, similar, uh, similar amounts, but just a little bit less, 4, 5, 6 inches towards O'Neill, Ainsworth, and Yankton, uh, and then half an inch or so uh, for central Nebraska. And the last model here, this is model number 6. Uh, this one also painting 7 to 10 inches for north central and north, northeastern Nebraska. So what are we saying here? We're saying the best chance for snow is north central and northeastern Nebraska, and then it tapers off the closer you get to Interstate 80. So this is my forecast where I'm saying 4 to 8 inches of snow from Valentine, uh, Valentine to O'Neill, maybe Norfolk. I think that'll be closer to the 2 to 4, and then the, higher, the further north you go, the higher the amounts. Further south you go, you're looking at a trace to one inch. Portions of northwest Nebraska, Shadron, Gordon, Hay Springs, places like that, two to four inches, maybe some six inch uh, totals in some spots. Uh, some of the models had some heavier spots out there as well. And then uh, once you get south of Interstate uh, Interstate 80, you're looking at probably nothing, but maybe a trace. Uh, so that's, uh, that's the forecast for now. Uh, I will have updates. I'm off Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Got a four day weekend coming up, but I'll, if I can do these, I will. Uh, it's uh, it's Thursday when I'm recording this, and we got a couple of days left, so uh, I I can't take a day I, I can take a day off, but it, you can't take a day off from the weather. That's just uh, that's the long and short of it. But you can follow me on all my social media pages. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, would love a subscription. Trying to get to a thousand, uh, really close. So I'd love if you could help me out there. Uh, all right, talk to you guys later.